Blogs give you a way to engage with visitors, increase SEO, and create and sustain a strong branding. If you haven't already created a blog, click on the Edit Menu button in your website's navigation, and then click the Create a New Page button. Enter a name for the blog page, choose Blog as the page type, and click Create. Once you've clicked to your blog page, click the Create Post button at the top of the page to create a blog post. Enter a title for the post and click Create. You can add content to your post in the same way content is added to a standard page. Click the Add Option button and then click the option you wish to choose. In addition to this, you can decide whether to turn the banner image on or off. We will notice an orange bar in the middle of the post. Content added above this point will be shown on the main blog page. Content added under this point will only be shown when visitors view the full post. Once you've added your content, you can decide whether to turn comments on or off. When you're done, you can select a variety of options for this particular post by clicking the post toolbar. First is the post title. The post title is the same as the page name. Below this is the page metadata. You can edit the page title and description. Next is the image as shown on social media when the page is shared. Finally, tags which let visitors browse posts on the same topic. Enter a tag and click add or press the enter key to add a tag. Click the cross next to an existing tag to remove it. When you are ready to publish a post, click the Publish Post button in the upper right. The page will be saved and the post will be published. You can see that the blog sidebar now has links for each tag and the month the post was published. Sometimes you might want to hide a post to make changes to it. To do this, go into Edit Mode and click the Revert to Draft button. After making changes, click the Publish Post button to republish the post. If you are not ready to publish your post but wish to save your changes, click the Save button in the bottom toolbar. This will save the draft post so you can go back and edit it later. You can also delete the post by clicking the Delete Page icon in the bottom toolbar. By returning to the main blog page, you can click the Settings button at the top of the page to control appearance of the blog. First choose whether to lay out the post in a single column of summaries, as a grid of large tiles, or as a grid of small tiles. When using a grid layout, the post banner image, title, and publication date will be shown in the tiles. Next, choose how many posts to show on each page, and finally choose how the publication date is displayed.